Toys Rap Battle League. We got two legends in the building right now. To my right. Hey, y'all, if, if Battle Rap had a Hall of Fame, I'd be first ballot. Uh, Drosy yeah, Boys, yeah. Upstairs Gang. I'm from the east side of Detroit. Yeah. There it is. Okay, okay, okay. Battle Rapper to my left. Mike Swift representing all living things in the world. Lipa City, Batangas, Brooklyn, Brighton Beach. What's up? Yeah. Let's go. I'm one of the best niggas doing this. Yeah. On God. That's on the crown straight to the sandals. And you? You finna be another trophy piece for the case or the mantle. It's about to get spooky for you, nigga. Can't you see my face in the candles? Because this is another year I said, Marv, stop fucking around. And everybody will be made an example. For example, Michael Swift. <laughs> Ain't nobody tell you that life's a bitch, dog. How you think this gonna end with you barking at Michael Vick? <laughs> <laughs> you already knew the outcome when you heard that I fight in pits. Fine. You already knew the outcome. You already knew the outcome when you heard that I fight in pits. Now you trying to talk greasy to a can of oil that's twice as slick. For that, for that, you gonna need a Ruger and a super tough enforcer. He better be a shooter. Somebody who can work the block and dish the rock. Basically, you gonna need a Hooper. I am, I am what they, come on now. Come on. Basically, look, basically you gonna need a Hooper. I am what they raving about, little lady. I can see the future. I said I am what they raving about, little lady. I can see the future. You know why he think of shit? Man. You know why he think of shit? Cause he's manure. Now the stakes is real high. Peter Luger. This nigga big bugging. He big bugging. Only up here armed with words. You better get something. But for the fifth dumping, and I have everybody in your click ducking, the bitch running, made it all the way home to get his big cousin, who did nothing. I say dig. I say, you big bugging, only up here armed with words, you better get something. But for the fifth dumping, and I have everybody that see your click ducking, the bitch running, made it all the way home to get his big cousin who did nothing, cause one name says it all, like Mick Lovin, nigga. I say, dig, y'all know me, nigga, I am what the violence is about. Tell me, I say, close the door before I have an eagle flying in your house. Tell the truth. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Nigga, I am what the violence is about. Close the door before I have an eagle flying in your house. Tell the truth or your people gonna leave you lying on the couch. I'm a conceited hitman with these clips. They gonna say, wow, he's wilding out. It's only three things promised in life, Mike. That's death and taxes and my legend status. When you play the game as good as Iverson, they should never expect you to step in practice. And you, you are practice. Right. Practice? Practice? You talking about practice? Talking about practice? On, that light ship in your light ship? How you gonna sell talking about Mike Vick with that pit? He went to jail. Fuck out of here, bars. What up, nutty professor? What's up? I'm about to extend your current slump, Sherman Clump. Or the Detroit slums turning up with the turkey gravy inside the thermos cup. It's the reason why I easy beat him, because instead of prepping, he's usually eating. When B said I'm better than Marv 1, my chinky eyes just pop. He said he idolized in the hood. I was like, which block? I'm terrorizing Op. My preparation is colorful. I vandalize your spot. His preparation to get full. Spanish rice, pasta, coconuts, McDonald's fries, apple pies on top. That should have him occupied while I strategize my shots. I was spotting for your Spotify, that shit was so hard to spot. Analyze your monthly listeners, said 549 on the dot. I mean, three decades in the game, that's the only thing you gotta show for. In fairness, there's only two things you're really known for. The Eminem ate my movie and the day past they ripped you another booty. That was ridiculous. Their rounds against you was the best thing I witnessed and battle rappers given us. Your legacy is soft. Your foundation is weak. I trained lightly for short. I took vacations for weeks. And since I heard it was Oakland, it put me at ease because I knew I was smoking right in front of my peeps. New height, new mic. Lower east side's true life 
With a billboard in Times Square By the blue lights before the used knife New York flair can't compare How dare I don't care about your legacy status I only battled you as Avenue to meeting Marshall Mathis and Nothing really matters cause I did it for toys Brooklyn to Detroit, I'm bringing that noise. Worldwide verified, keeping my poise and getting views from my fellow Pinoys and hopefully become a key to get a feature from Royce. Mm. What up, Royce? Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Seriously, man, come on. How you gonna put that mirror on Sharon? Look in the mirror, make it clear who's bullshitting who. When I stare at myself, I say I wish I was you. When you stare at yourself, you say you wish you was who? You wish you was true instead portraying a thug. Say what you want. My main source says you be faking the funk. Da, 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 da. Faking the funk and judging from the bungee, you are faith in the jump. Don't get stepped on like a pedal by this fucking rebel. Why you could kill two birds with one stone, my equal could never be your level unless you can kill five eagles with one pebble. I said, you could kill two birds, one stone, my equal could never be your level unless you can kill five eagles with one pebble. Sawadikap, 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 tanginaka. Time. <laughs> All right, all right. So you, Marv. First of all, pause, because no rapper has ever torn me a new booty. <laughs> that statement. That is crazy, my boy. It is what it is. Pause. Cameron said. Pause, nigga. No rapper has ever torn me a new booty. When my people saw the flyer, they literally asked, hey, yo, who's he? You should have known better than to try to approach up here with a goonie. Battling you makes me realize how much we really miss Looney. Nigga, <laughs> hey, God said drink the Kool-Aid. Ain't nothing violent about you. You a big shizu. When they told you that they booked you with one of the best of all times, you should have believed it. Because the shit's true. I will kill, I will kill whoever guards your galaxy. I'm talking Whistler 2. I dare you to get through a round clean up here. And I'm gonna let a round get clean through you. And they, when they saw my face on the flyer, even the sponsors was elated. They knew they could pull up, have a good time, see some women, you know, honoring my greatness. That kind of makes me the captain, Mike. So tell me who got a problem with my lateness? I'm Dr. Frankenstein. I'm just here to kill the monster I've created. You my child. You're my child. Your entire round is talking about what you can get from me. Thinking he gonna crack eggs and make an omelet until he leave with his shit runny. Yeah, I got. <laughs> until he leave with his shit runny. Yeah, I got booked, but then your car got pulled. This is Jen Rummy, and if he keep and if he keep talking junk, it's gonna hurt to give my son this big dummy. You jive, you jive turkey. Why would you make me carve into you, knowing that I fathered most of this fucking style? It's nothing but a lot of Marvin Juniors. I'll spark a Ruger. Knowing that, why would you alarm the shooter? Now you got the old man screaming on you, like Arthur Spooner. Nigga, this. <laughs> These are the big leagues. I want to welcome you to the NBA. In the spur of the moment, I'll take out your first pick. It's like watching Wimby play. <laughs> knowing I'll do that, <laughs> knowing I'll do that, it ain't smart to offend me, okay? Cause this can go from a this can go to a disaster real easy without an NDA. I look, it's only three things promised in life, boy. That's death and taxes and my legend status. When you play the game as good as Iverson, they should never expect you to step in practice. Mike, you are practice. Round. Don't be pointing this way this day. How you gonna? Compare yourself to Wemby when he's seven six this way. You're seven six this way. <laughs> Fuck out of here. Okay. I keep it consistent. Be nasty, insistent. He offered a large bag. I couldn't resist it. But B, you said legend versus legend. Legend versus legend. You think that ain't hurt? Especially this man ain't put in the same work. Battle rap ain't enough for you to gain perks over a complete artist like me, we ain't the same worth. So before I slay a merkin and turn this planet to lay earth, sorry if I may curse you, be nasty, but that's why I fucking ask you to send the money and pay first. Good looking though, guy. 
Okay. I want this knee. This kid is goofy. I recorded with Suge Knight. I'm in the Biggie movie. When it comes to hip hop, I partook in all the elements. You all saw an all star and Paul George. I brought LeBron James to the tournament. How you gonna top that, you fat ass pork? I'm all year touring and performing to the TEDx talk. I get paid by the biggest bands to guess in they sets for the biggest brands. While your biggest plan, I bet to this day, and I'm feeling damn it's still being stand. Marv's gone cold, we wondering why. It's gone out of bed at all. Now I search, you got an air mattress, motherfucker. Yeah, let's talk about the songs you're sitting on. Please find a way to stop. That's why you made air mattress, because you're trying to make it pop. And I search another one, clock on them. What's that, another subliminal distance slim? The Kembe Matumbo block on them after they shot the film. Cause after that, no more contact. You gave him your beats, trap, boom, bap, for a recording contract. Take it in your triple chin, he threw it in the tin can trash. He said he don't want that. <laughs> I saw your math half his podcast and I can't see him to see where to pin him. And I swear, all I can think of is how you fit in that chair. There, that's my expert opinion. <laughs> I watch with extra care as round as you all sitting like a square looking like Big T without dreads in his hair. I was waiting for the air pressure, I swear. If we wiggle just a little, you'll destroy that chair. You know when you know when you're not healthy? When you gotta fly your own drone just to catch your own selfie. Your father's a fat, so your mother's a fatty. Your brother and sister shall be in flabby. Now you wonder why you're so fucking unhappy, because obesity is the only that runs in your family. And don't talk like Asian, like I'm um, some karate shit, all right? <laughs> like I'm here to teach karate, like a, I'm a crash test, test dummy ready to be a body when this is all a setup for me to be a Rocky. Versus an Apollo in D against a Geechee Gotti or, you know, a Tay Rock or easy to block. Not a chump like you, that's easy to drop. More like an Arsenal, a murder mook, gangster, pro with the bars. Now, B, I know I don't know them dudes from a hole in the wall, but for the right amount of do, I'm going to war. But legend versus legend, why you call him for? Three decades in the game, still waiting for M's call. Don't talk. Don't talk that short shit, cause this little, this little man, bro, wait till the next round, see who gonna stand tall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you, let's go. Yo, that, that's hilarious, that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hilarious. <laughs> Hey look, hey look, hey look, it's a couple people in the game who want me to retire. Too bad, you stuck with me. <laughs> Just know if I say it's on site, believe it's always up with me. I can't believe they booked you thinking that you could fuck with me. You bragged about being in the movies. Yeah, as Asian guy number three. <laughs> This is the final fantasy, because I'm seeing too many players run from the mill. I say, I'm seeing too many players run from the real. They only booked you here because they knew you was dumb enough to come and get killed. I'll never let anybody judge my lanes or referee him because he's running the mills. This is MOP. Saying my name for a little fame always comes with a bill. And I'm, what? And I'm that damn guy. You heard anything other than that's a damn lie. The pistol talk. His, he don't know when his spear taking off. This nigga flying standby. <laughs> he flying standby and I drop bodies. I'm a cold son of a bitch with this hot shoddy. He heard I was froze, stuck his chest out and got a hot toddy. Boy, anything that could have went wrong, went wrong. This a botched robbery. <laughs> The only description is the rapper had his face covered like Mahami. Look, I am, boy, I'm a rare fighter who stay with a drum, I'll play a snare by you. I don't do grease. I'll pull a new heat out the box. Would you like an air fryer? I'll send him, I'll send him right, I'll send him right at you. This white castle, I got prepared sliders. Nigga, you. 
I'm different. I'm different. I say, dig. I can't, I'm gonna forget it. I say, look, I got prepared sliders. You have the look and, an, and the odor that proves that no woman would dare try you. I say, I say, look, you are not for real. If you make it to the spittle, I'll have the doctor killed. Boy, the chopper will. Cut your plans off at the knees like Cotton Hill. Nigga. No. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, bro. I say, look, surviving in my jungle, that's a proper skill. Because we got the fiends waiting on the white girl outside, like Dr. Phil. How, like Dr. Phil. How about that? I'll slide the doors on the van and hop out that. Nigga, I'll put the beams everywhere you look. You a house cat. All you feel is the, what? I say, nigga, how about that? I slide the doors on the van and hop out that. I'll put beams everywhere you look. You a house cat. All you feel is the metal slamming on you. It's a mouse trap. For what's, let's go, take it easy. I almost didn't wrap this. I say, this. It's a mouse trap. And for what's at stake? For what's at stake? I'll peel your onion and fry it. Welcome to Outback. I'm a motherfucking legend, nigga. I'm a legend, nigga. Is you crazy, dude? I'm a Detroit nigga. And I just brought them 380s through, and the last thing he gonna see is that D over that navy blue. Like, nigga, look what you made me do. Bring it home, bring it home, bring it home. Mike, Mike Swift, it's on you, fight back! See all the names that you mentioned? Well, I gave them attention. I put them in the grave of detention. If they play with my pay or my pension. Not only I built the cars from the hood to the emblem, I'm the one that gave him the gas for the ride, the one that made him the engine. From the pesos I sent him, the phrases and sentences straight into trending, I was the instrument of truth, the way they pretending, I wish that I can speak to proof. Say sorry for sending his friend's career to the near ending, his death is here, it's clear, but you in heaven now, so never mind. It's devil's time, I brought hella rhymes. I know you battled legends fine, but today you're gonna lose to someone who battled just for the second time. <laughs> Between Swift and Marv, one who's the odd one? Battle rap community, I beg your pardon. Okay, see this hardens like Katie Russell Harden, how I played the part in history I disregarded. Check the timeline prior grind time. My Sunugan League is six in the world right now, but I know Flip Top is number one, but as long as Jehan and Looney is with Sunugan, they ain't even fucking with him. And we did a lot of different shit like fucking uh, TV, press con, movie theaters, Sunugan Bad Blood was infamy. Apex of the day was when I met. I got help from a friend of me that got to mix battle rap with an orchestra symphony. Fine. And to prove this point, I post a video of Pumpkinhead, PH. That's the last time I saw you was a Sean, uh, Sean Price was still. Rest in peace to PH, Pumpkinhead, and Sean Price. Mm -hmm. But this is my, my, my promise to him. And you know, he got a, a street named after Robert Diaz. I gotta show love to PH. Mm -hmm. And to prove this point, I post a video of PH these days, repaint the history and replay. Looney versus disaster in the PH, where Ali and Frazier re raised the bar in boxing. You can see Swave Sever, I ask him. Heat wave, so title DVD was out in three days. That's action. Matter of fact, less. You should battle rap less, cause you're looking sad, yes. While your gas is on E on my chest, it says S. Superman to a Luther, winner to a loser. Why you eluding the fact that your real job is driving Uber? Uber Eats. You know, but ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. That's how you got that big. Ain't nothing wrong with fucking having a, a job, but don't deliver the food, deliver the food, bring it door to door. I'm only saying that because you got seen before. Pulling up with your car, grabbing on the bag, chewing on the fries, even sipping on the drink in a second of a blink. Got seen, didn't think. Your boss should have put you in the kitchen doing dishes in the sink, but the chefs don't like it because they saying that you stink. Impossible. <laughs> Impossible. Stop lying. <laughs> <laughs> Stop lying, you piece of pork. 
in Detroit to get support to the streets in New York. Trying to talk slick like Rick, but can't toot my horn. With stories of Sally, from the valley work to John. I say a prayer to my stupid ass goons when I'm done fishing with my rod, bending it swells with harpoons. Build me for my lamb beer with every bar. Damn real, I chuck it back daily. I swear to God, yo, do Mars or do Earth. Whatever planet, John's son Vinny, he do work. Mark my word, Marv, he's wearing a guire. Him snitching, get you hurt. I pissed on your grave and toys and got destroyed. Expose you as a fake, you're not a bad boy from Detroit. Only old school motherfuckers can know this. Rick Mahorn, I say ya, pray ya, Tomas. Yes, good. Dennis, you know, nerd shit that y'all do. Battle rappers that have nothing to do, just battle rap, that nerd shit. Anyway. <laughs> what? So, so what's your man? Let's go. You got, hey, you gotta learn the truth to be able to learn to live with the past. Oh. Cause you gotta learn a Yo, here's some truth. You gotta learn to live with the facts. Can't have a sweet future with that bit of fat, with that, you can't have a sweet future with that bit of past. You gotta ignore people that think that you're fat. Come on, Marv One, you know you're bigger than that. <laughs> I said, you gotta learn to live with the facts. You can't have a sweet future with that bit of past. You gotta ignore people that think that you're fat. Come on, Marv One, you know you're bigger than that. Levels, right? There's yeah. levels, yeah, yeah. but you're only rap and make beats. It's two birds and one stone don't equal my level because I can kill five eagles with one pebble. Sawadikap, sawadikap, sawadikap. Mabuhay mahalika, kap kum kap, legend. Legend. Hey, make some noise for that right now.